So, you have been waiting for the CES 2021, right? Well, the time has finally arrived and, like every year, CS 2021 is happening right now and all the manufacturers are ready to show their latest innovative gadgets and products. So in today's video, we will show you the top 10 brands launch products at CS 2021 in no particular order. So without further ado, let's see what CS 2021 has got for us. LG has brought a couple of new laptops at the CES 2021 which includes two convertible laptops in 14 and 16 inch screen sizes while the other grams are in 14, 16 and 17 inch screen sizes. Out of them, the Gram 16 is certified as the world's lightest 16 inch laptop by the Guinness Book of World Records. And all these laptops have been repackaged with an improved 16 by 10 ratio display that will help you enhance all of your productivity. These laptops are Intel EVA Platform Certified, powers an 11 Gen Intel processor with Iris XE graphics. Watching TV in bed is already an everyday luxury, but the 55-inch transparent OLED Smart Bed is a concept from LG Display that achieves 40% transparency. It's not a bed itself, but rather a unit that sits at the foot of your bed that has got a transparent display which can slide in and out of its housing. Another one is the LG Spendable OLED display which utilizes an extremely thin OLED panel and features a 48 inch screen size. With a tap of a button, this display can unfold to a curvature of 1000R for immersion while gaming. Besides, it can also be straightened out to a flat display while watching regular TV shows. On top of that, this TV uses a cinematic sound OLED or CSO panel which has an ultra thin film exciter underneath to turn the entire screen into a loudspeaker. To bring the cinematic experience into your home, LG has introduced its Cinebeam projector. This projector features an 8.3 megapixel sensor that delivers a true 4K UHD resolution at up to 300 inches of projection screen size. Besides, it features adaptive contrast and brightness optimizer with 97% dual laser DCI P3 color space with a huge 2 million by 1 contrast ratio. This projector also adopts the HDR Pro technology with dynamic tone mapping to deliver optimized picture quality in each time. It also offers a filmmaker mode and runs on the WebOS 5.0 operating system which will let you explore a variety of TV shows and movies with a simple connection to your Wi-Fi network. So LG has also introduced a couple of extraordinary monitors at this CS event. Out of them, the first is the LG Ultra Gear models, which are the 34-inch 34GP 950G, the 27-inch 27GP 950, and the 32-inch 32GP 850. The 34-inch Ultra Gear monitor offers ultra-low latency gameplay with NVIDIA Juicing Ultimate compatibility for playing games at maximum smoothness. On the other hand, the 27-inch model is compatible with the latest consoles like PlayStation 5 or Xbox Series X and offers HDMI 2.1 with a variable refresh rate to play games at a true 4K or even 8K pretty smoothly. Another one is the 32-inch version, which offers an IPS panel with 1 millisecond grade to grade response time with a larger field of view to play fast-paced titles without any lag. Besides the Ultra Gear models, LG has also introduced its 40-inch 40WP95C ultrawide monitor, which offers true 5120x2160 ultrawide resolution to provide the ultimate productivity. And it also offers Thunderbolt connectivity for better compatibility and cable connectivity. Apart from the Ultra Gear and Ultra Wide models, LG has also introduced an Ultra Fine monitor, which is a 32 inch 32 EP950 model. This is LG's first ever OLED monitor that has got 99% of DCI P3 color gamut, which can be highly beneficial for visual tech and for creative professionals. LG is also throwing a CS checklist event. And by clicking the link that you'll find in the description box, it will take you to their Gleam page where you can participate by simply answering 5 entries and LG will select 100 lucky winners who will get $20 of gift cards. Samsung has also made its mark in this year's virtual CES event by introducing their latest 4K and 8K new QLED as well as a massive 110-inch 4K TV micro LED. The new QLED TVs integrate Quantum Mini LED panel that is further assisted by Quantum Matrix and 
new content processor for a precise and optimized visual experience. Besides, they also come with their latest rechargeable remote which can be charged with this included USB Type-C port or solar panel. Samsung is taking micro LED and putting it into a more traditional TV form factor. They announced the massive 110 inch 4K TV as micro LED and you will not really notice any bezels or borders as they has a 99.99% screen to body ratio. Samsung still managed to build in an embedded majestic sound system that it claims delivers breathtaking 5.1 channel sound with no external speaker. Samsung has put forward a new range of S and Q series soundbars in the CES 2021 to go along with the latest QLED TVs that have Dolby Atmos playback, calibration microphone and one-click bass boost mode. The Chromebook has gone through some improvements and in this CES event, Samsung has unveiled the Galaxy Chromebook 2, a 2-in-1 laptop that comes with a 1080p QLED display, updated Chrome OS and an optimized battery all at a reduced price point. Samsung has also entered into intelligent robotics and introduced a robot that breaks barriers for all with human-centered AI. This robot has a display on the front to which you can have a video meeting with your colleagues. Besides, there is another robot that can be your housekeeping companion as it can do your essential household works or whatever you command just to make your life simpler and convenient. ASAR has also joined the CES 2021 hype train with a trio of gaming monitors which are targeted towards the next-gen console and competitive gamers. The 28-inch Nitro kicks off the monitor list with its console variable refresh rate support of whopping 144Hz refresh rate at 4K and HDMI 2.1 connectivity option for the Xbox Series X and PS5 console. And then they've got the Predator XB273U NX, a stunning 1440p monitor with a maximum refresh rate of 240Hz and also comes with 95% P3 color gamut which simply means innate color quality. Lastly, they've got the 32-inch Predator XB323QK Envy, which is more or less similar to the Nitro 1 with a twist of display HDR400 support and a 90% P3 color gamut that showcases the fascinating color quality. ASAR takes AMD for a Chromebook spin for the CS 2021. Among plenty of other Chromebooks that have appeared in the 2021 CS event, this 14-inch ASAR spin 514 stands out of the crowd as it incorporates the latest Ryzen 3000C processors and up to Ryzen 7 3700C. Sony Electronics has announced its latest Sony Bravia XR TVs, which offer both 4K and 8K resolutions. This series of TVs come with the latest Cognitive Processor XR, which uses a completely new processing method designed to replicate the ways humans see and hear. Besides, these TVs will feature HDMI 2.1 compatibility, including 4K 120fps, variable refresh rate, auto low latency mode, and eARC to support higher resolutions and frame rates, which is ideal for next-generation PS5 and Xbox One X gaming. JBL has launched multiple new wireless earbuds at this CES event to compete with the AirPods Pro. Surprisingly, all of these earbuds are engineered with adaptive noise cancelling and smart ambient technology. The JBL Live Pro Plus has eco-canceling mic technology, wireless charging feature and comes in four color options including black, white, pink and beige. On the other hand, the JBL Live Free NC Plus offers IPX7 water resistant rating, wireless charging and comes in four color options that includes black, blue, white and rose. Another one is the JBL Reflect Mini NC TWS which offers 6mm drivers, earphones for a secure feed and can be used independently. Lastly, we got the JBL Tour Pro Plus, which comes with 6.8mm drivers, adaptive ambient aware and talk-through feature as well as a 3-mic beamforming array for clear voice quality. JBL has also released a multi-beam soundbar, which is the JBL Bar 5.0. This is an all-in-one soundbar that has simulated Dolby Atmos effects and supports Alexa and Google Assistant commands. Besides, JBL also said that it will be compatible with Amazon's multi array music protocol, which will let you group eco speakers together. Lenovo has also refreshed their ThinkPad lineup. The newest model to the lineup is the ThinkPad X1 Titanium Yoga, which features a 3 x 2 aspect ratio, 11mm Z height, and weighs only 1.15kg. 
On the other hand, the ThinkPad X1 Carbon Gen 9 and the ThinkPad X1 Yoga Gen 6 are both getting the 11th Gen Intel Core processors, 16x10 displays and a wider trackpad and a larger battery. On top of that, the Yoga Gen 6 has got the 360-degree hinge for added versatility. Finally, there is a new ThinkPad X12 detachable 12.3-inch convertible tablet that features up to 11th Gen Intel Core i7 CPU with a single Thunderbolt 4 port as well as a second USB Type-C port which offers USB 3.2. Besides the X1 series, Lenovo also announced for the Lenovo IdeaPad 5 Pro and the IdeaPad 5 iPro laptops. These laptops offer two different processors as the 5 Pro is available with AMD Ryzen processors while the 5 iPro supports the 11th gen Intel counterpart. Both of them come in 14 and 16 inch models where the 14 inch has got refresh rate of up to 90 Hz whilst the 16 inch will give you a maximum of 120 Hz for smooth gameplays. Besides, they have also launched the Yoga AIO 7, an all-in-one desktop PC that is powered by AMD Renault 4008 series APUs and also comes with RTS 2060 GPU. And according to Lenovo, it can also be used as a standalone 4K smart TV through a future update. While the last year's Tab P11 Pro was aimed at professionals, this year at CES, Lenovo has remodeled the tablet by labeling it Tab P11 and giving it an 11-inch IPS LCD screen that is targeted at families. The screen is as usual, touch-enabled and has a native resolution of 2000 by 1200 pixels. The TCL 6 series was a big hit in the previous year and that is why in this year's CS Expo, TCL, they have introduced the 8K variant with a massive 85-inch display to keep the crown. With all other features remain more or less the same, the pricing is just unbelievable as it might be one of the most affordable 8K screens available on the market. It doesn't just stop right here, as TCL has also showcased their rollable phone concept, which normally is a 6.7-inch phone but can expand to up to 7.8-inch screen and completely transform it into a tablet, including the UI. At CS 2021, HP has debuted various laptops. The Elite Dragonfly G2 offers a 5G connectivity, lightweight design, integrated tile tracking, and the HP Temple Lock Intrusion Detection technology. On the other hand, the Elite Dragonfly Max features a 5-megapixel camera with 4 wide-range microphones, 5G connectivity, and 11 gen Intel Core processors. Besides, the HP Elite Folio features an optional 5G connectivity, a pull-forward mode where the 13.5-inch screen can come forward and magnetically lock into position closer to your viewing. Another one is the EliteBook 840 Arrow G8 that has an optional 5G connectivity and a starting weight of 2.5 pounds. The HP EliteBook X360 2030 G8 will come with 11 gen Intel Core V Pro processors and an optional USD OLED display, while the 14-inch EliteBook X3 3040 G8 will include an option for a USD HDR display with up to 550 nits of brightness. Lastly, the HP Elite X2 G8 is a 2-in-1 tablet series that offers integrated tile tracking and AI-based technology for suppressing background noises. Dell has finally joined the 5K resolution game by launching their ultra-sharp U4021QW, which is a 40-inch curved monitor and offers 98% DCI-P3 colors with exceptional visuals. At the down back side, this monitor carries a dock station that includes all the necessary ports that you could ever imagine. And to complement your monitor even more, Dell also has launched the SB521A soundbar, which has got the world's slimmest design and magnetically attaches below the monitor. Besides, it has got 3.6 watt speakers that can deliver rich crystal clear audio as well. Panasonic has also teased the latest 4K TV at CES 2021, which is packing an unparalleled surround sound system, a beautiful 4K OLED panel, and lots of visual technology such as HDR10+, Dolby Vision IQ, and HDR10 Plus Adaptive. Mercedes-Benz presents the MBUX Hyperscreen, the unique screen unit consisting of three Apparently seamlessly merged displays is not only the largest human-machine interface, but also by far the most intelligent, aesthetically impressive and radically easy to operate. Thanks to improved AI, the display and operating system adapt seamlessly to the user and make personalized suggestions for numerous infotainment, comfort and vehicle functions depending on the situation. 
at this CES, we have also seen the PAL-V flying car. Dutch company PAL-V thinks it can change that with its Liberty flying car. At first glance, the Liberty looks like it took the design specs from the Audi R8, the Helio P4. However, it's not a helicopter. It's in fact an autogyro, a type of aircraft first built and flown in the early 1920s. So that was all about the top 10 brands launch products at CES 2021 just for you. Thanks for watching our video. Like, comment and share with your friends if you found this video helpful. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos like this on your feed.